Piscato, Piscato, tomato, tomato, potato, Piscato. Buenos dias, seniors and senoritas. My name's Rob Hewley. Checking in here from the beautiful Canadian Rockies. You're asking, what does Piscato mean? It means fish in Spanish, amigos. Unfortunately for me, I'm a bit of a surfer stuck in a skier's body. But luckily, Line made the Piscato. The Line Piscato with, you know, the 125 underfoot, the swallowtail, and the giant shovel, it's just gonna cruise through powder. Like any deep snow, best day of the season, this is the ski that you wanna be on. It's soft, so it's still really playful, but it's gonna handle anything, you know, if you wanna jump off something. When you're landing in really deep pow, the tail sinks in and it keeps your tips up allowing that, that ski to really float out of those landings. Still carves so well. It's spent you know, a little bit of time on groomers today and just had a blast. It also performs really well on the groomers. The ski has a lot of side cut to it, which really allows you to rail turns on the corduroy and really get low and trust the ski and know it's gonna hold an edge for you. What's up guys? Hanging out here with the line Sakana. Start over. It's all right, Sakana, I'll say Sakana. This is the narrower version, a little bit more geared towards your all mountain feel. And where the Piscato is gonna be great in the deep snow, real surfy, real playful, the Sakana is going to do the entire mountain in the same fashion. We spent all morning carving groomers and laying the ski over felt amazing. The thing I love about the swallow tail is the ability to really release the tail on a turn. It allows, it allows you to slide a turn and really take advantage of that power, that bank that you're you're turning on and, and it's just a beautiful surfy sliding feeling when you're when you're riding this ski. They're unreal. I have the best time of my life skiing on these things and I think you will too.